Today we're going to carve a linoleum block and I've got a couple of tools here. I've got the linoleum block that I've already done my sketch on and then I've got this uh, non-skid mat that I'm going to use as an alternative to the bench hook. It's just a piece of material that you put underneath a rug and that way when I am carving it's not going to slide and I'm not going to get hurt. I also have this speedball linoleum cutter with a blade here. It's the number two. And what I'm going to basically be doing is I'm going to be carving away the areas that I want to be white. You always want to hold your tool in the palm of your hand as if you were holding a shovel. Okay, and It's kind of like ice cream scoops that just scoop away the very surface of it. So I'll hold it like this. I'll always cut away from myself. I never want to go like this. I never want to put my other hand in the way and accidentally cut there. So um, if you ever need to cut sideways, you can just turn your linoleum block that direction. So I'm going to start with a very simple cut. I'm going to go on the outside of this line here that I drew. And I'm using this finger here to kind of guide it but it's just a little push and you let the tool do the work. I'm going to lift up and I get that little piece flaked away. Then I'm going to come back in. And now for this one, I'm going to come in here because I want that angle really sharp. So I'm going to come at it from the other direction. Sometimes if you have a curve like this, you can start cutting and then turn your block as you go so that your blade always stays in front of you. <laughs> 